gente bella y bienvenidos a mi canal. My name is Sandra. If this is your first time here, and welcome to my channel. In this channel, you'll be learning and I'll be speaking about everything high-end or luxury candle making business tips. So in today's video, I wanted to recreate this um, image that I saw on this email that I received from Joe Malone Candles, and I thought it was very, very pretty. I don't want to copy it exactly to the T, but it did give me an idea. So what I wanted to share with you is how I recreate this picture. Uh, well, yeah, it's a picture, but in my email. So I'm going to try and see if I could put the um, email either over here or over here of the image that I want to recreate. And I'm going to be using my faux, um, ooh, it's hot. <sighs> my faux uh, tile and I'm going to stick the last two pieces to my already made tile board because as I was trying to do this earlier and I'll insert a picture or image here I realized that it didn't look that cohesive because it was not done on one end and because my sink is really close to a wall if it was like a freestanding sink or it didn't have a wall directly to one of the sides then i would have probably moved over the entire uh board but because i cannot do that and the board that i was using i can't really unstick these on the board so i could have a longer wall full tile wall per se so this is why I couldn't do that and I tried to go get some more from Walmart but this Walmart um it didn't have anything it was completely empty and I was very upset well I don't want to say upset I was more disappointed than upset because I thought that I was going to try and finish off my faux bathroom wall but I couldn't but anyways so um I did have two extra leftovers from my previous um uh, encounter or what I wanted to do so I had two extra ones so I'm glad that I did have two extra ones because now I could use it I was thinking about buying a brand new one but then I was like um that's a lot of money to be wasting on these fake tiles just to recreate a picture so yeah these things are not cheap by the way even if I bought it from Walmart maybe if I would have probably went to Home Depot which is a lot cheaper for a box but anyways I didn't want to go to Home Depot because Home Depot was not close to me and yeah, I didn't want to do all that, so since I had two left over, so we'll do that. And then we'll see how to recreate that picture in a few minutes. So I'm actually going to transition you guys over to my little floor area, which I'm going to call my arts and craft area, but it's actually my floor. So you guys can see me uh, stick these two, then we're going to move over to my kitchen, no, bathroom, yeah, bathroom. To, over on my left side I think it'll be your right side when you guys see this video but over to my left side and you will see how I do my recreation of a very nice picture that you already seen and you'll see it one more time right here so you guys can see that and let's get to it Okay, so I gotta figure out how, uh, which side I'm going to put on the sink. So I think my sink, it's on this side. So the wall is right here and I want to complete this side of my tile. So this right here is actually my uh, wood floors that I put on my stairs and I had these left over so I just decided to use this as my wall my full wall and then I taped it with um painter's tape because painter's tape tend to come out a lot better than any other paint and I didn't want this to be permanent I want it to be temporary so that's why I use this um my wooden floor thing my wood floor so this is what it looks on the back side. Oh, if I could lift it. Okay. So this is what it looks like on the back side. So I taped it all the way through. 
and you guys can see this is what it looks like let me bring it up closer so this right here is what the board looks like which is my wooden floors and i take this on the back and made this my full wall so we'll put this back on the floor and i'm going to remove the backing of the fake tile and we're going to place it on the uh, board that I have here and I'm going to make sure that I cover the extra edges that has little writings on them I know you can't see it but it's there and I did this several times because um, at the beginning it looked okay like the first tile looked okay and then when I tried to re uh, stick the second tile it kind of looked a little lopsided so you're gonna see me reapply apply reapply and apply again several times until i get it correctly because when you don't have the the corners or the edges correctly placed on there it's going to look all messed up and you're going to see that i do have like a little area and i'll point that out in a minute where i do have a little red that comes through from the backboard but when i edit my pictures i actually remove it and i do like a little copy and paste and you could see how i do that in my product picture taking and editing and i'll link that video right in the uh, description box and also in a minute on the screen so I'm still here trying to fix my mistake and I'm pretty sure like I'm cursing at myself that I didn't do this correctly, which is not only that those two, it's mostly the others that actually accounted for that. And now I'm pointing out the one that has the little line. Okay, so let me show you guys what it looks like. Okay, this was the last two pieces that I put. And this will be the top, and this right here will be the bottom. So let's go over to my bathroom so we could see how it all come up together.
bothering me scratching on my door so let me know if you guys thought that what I recreated based on the Joe Malone's email that I received image was a close to the original or was it better than the original did I slay that shot and let me know in the comments down below what you thought about it don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you could be in the know of my next video and hasta la próxima bye mi gente bella say bye Romeo say bye Romeo look at that look at that look at that look, look at the camera look at the camera say bye